Hey Leos, welcome back to my channel. I'm here to do your weekly message. This message is going to be from the 23rd through the 29th. Let's see what's in store for you. This is your weekly message. Come on. Hopefully it's something good. Death card. Ooh. Transformations, endings, new beginnings. I don't know. Let's ask my crystal ball. Nine of Cups. Wish fulfillment. Wishes being granted. Something that's going to begin. There had to be an ending to begin something that is very emotionally fulfilling to you. Something that you worked hard for. Something that you really, really wanted. And in order for that to have happened, there had to be an ending to the old. Six of Swords. With this, it's like you either relocated, you moved somewhere that you really, really wanted to. Maybe you're traveling. Whatever it was, you had to get the fuck out, get the hell out of Dodge, wherever you were. <laughs> King of Pentacles. You could be married or you could be the boss, right? The breadwinner. Maybe you landed some money and you're able to uh, go places. I feel like some of you were just like up and leaving your job. You're like, I quit. I got what I wanted. I'm able to be free and travel the world. I'm able to do what I want. I don't need you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> type of shit but seems like my Leos are living the life right now so good week ahead you're gonna be doing a lots of festivities Ooh, maybe you're blocking a past lover from coming in or maybe you had to let go of someone from the past and ending to something from the past What did I say? Sun card. Emotionally fulfilled. You see that? Nine of cups and the sun. Someone is happy. Someone's on a happy pill. Either that or you are just like I said, living your best life. That's exactly what my crystal ball is telling me. Great things are coming for you, Leo. Great things are coming. It's already happening. Oh, but be careful. Someone is trying to be sneaky. They're trying to get away with something. Maybe you caught them. Keep your eye out. People see you happy, shining. They might want to get away. They might want to take something that's yours. Hmm, be very, very careful with those around you, Leo. Don't mess with the Leo, yo. Go and get your head chopped off, bit off. Magician. Oh, Leos, Leos, Leos. You are the ultimate manifester this week, right? Manifesting everything that you want. I think this is like you putting your intentions into the universe, mm -hmm. knowing how to work with alchemy. Look at that, happiness. You put your uh, manifestations to the universe. You said a multi B, and now you are living your best life. Great things are coming for you. Great things are happening. You are going to be so happy. Okay? Super, super happy. I love this upcoming week for you. Look at that. Star card. Yep. You are feeling very, very hopeful about the future now. You're looking to the stars. Mm-hmm. Look into the stars. You have great cards here. Sun, the star, magician, death. There could have been an ending to your old karmic ways, and now you are living your best life. 
not giving a fuck what people say or think. But be careful, watch out, there's always that sneaky motherfucker coming around trying to break you of your happiness. Nope, you're gonna show them who's boss, right? Let's get a lover's oracle for my Leos. Emotions are a natural and necessary part of life, but they can also distort your perception and cloud your vision. In order to see things clearly, you must let go of resentment. I feel like that's what you had let go of, walked away from. Maybe it put an ending to some kind of resentment with someone or something, maybe even with yourself. And that's what's helping you move on, helping you become more happy. Then we have, there is, there. let there be closeness between you, but always give each other space. Love never claims, it simply allows and gives. Love never gives, or not love. Love <laughs> never claims, it simply allows and gives. Okay? You cannot claim somebody, although sometimes if they like to be claimed, they will let you claim them, right? Mm-hmm. Leo, you can claim whoever the fuck you want and you can get away with it. Mm-hmm. That's just my Leo's. The last card we have is Embrace. Through each other, you find the missing pieces. Ooh, maybe... You are all lovey-dovey, cuddle on the couch, walking, watching Hocus Pocus, Netflix and chill, with somebody that you really, really love, makes you really, really happy. Your wish come true, he could be your king. Well, Leo, this upcoming week looks very, very great. I'm happy for you. I don't see any negative cards except for this sneaky motherfucker. So be careful, okay? Alright Leo, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in your next video.